People waited in lines across the tri-state to get the new iPhone. And the tensions were so high that a fight even broke out in California. Oh, my goodness. Here, the excitement ended quickly for some unhappy customers at Kenwood Town Center. And that's where John Mattery spent the morning getting reaction about Apple's newest phone so you don't waste your money. John? Well, Carol, when Apple releases a new iPhone, it's not just a phone, it's an event. People waited in line overnight in Kenwood to be among the first in the tri-state to have one of the new phones. But just because you wait in line for hours doesn't mean you'll be happy with your purchase. By the time the cheers started up at 8 a.m., many of the 400 people outside Cincinnati's Apple store had been waiting as long as 12 hours. Through the glass windows, like forbidden fruit, sat the new iPhone 5S in 5C in multiple colors. And it was those new colors that have created demand we haven't seen in a while. So much demand that some people paid placeholders to stand in line for them. I am standing in line for somebody who wants to get the iPhone in the morning, but doesn't have time or doesn't want to wait for the whole time. But even paying someone to wait was no guarantee you could get the phone in the color you hoped for. Frustrations soon started to show. When you're less than 50 people in a line that's this deep, you kind of expect that you're going to get what you want. And this is the first time I've been totally disgusted, not because I didn't necessarily get my first choice in phones, but they weren't honest and forthright and didn't come out and tell hundreds of people that all you could get is space gray. Only the first few people, among them Ben White, number one in line, were able to score a coveted gold phone. So you have the gold? Yeah, yeah. One of the Indeed. select few, yeah, six people. Only six people got only the gold six today. people got a gold one today. So few gold models were available that it's now on back order on Apple's website. And already some sellers are asking $1,000 or more on eBay. But like the golden ticket to Willy Wonka's chocolate factory that every kid wanted and so few kids could get, the new gold iPhone could end up one of the most wanted and most elusive Apple products ever. And that elusive gold phone that people want, well, Apple says it won't be shipping that out again until next month. So be prepared to pay a lot of money on eBay for it. Coming up at 5.30, a warning about extended warranties that you should know before you buy ones. So you don't waste your money. Carol and Tanya. John and Tanya, I remember standing in line for a Game Boy for my daughter. But this is grown-ups, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs>